Uh, well, thanks for all these great ideas about sharing ICT in the classroom. Uh, ICT is important, but as many of you know, in a lot of schools it has completely replaced computer science. And I want us to think about whether or not that was the right thing to do. Uh, the first statistic to me says it all. One quarter of all vacant jobs advertised in NI Job Finder require computing skills. Um, in many other disciplines, especially in the sciences but also the arts, the thinking processes of computing, such as problem solving, are vital. Even for students who do not go on to third level education, an understanding of computation is important to make sense of today's digital world. And five years ago, computing at school was set up as a working group within the British Computer Society, but uh, is not, now has its own independent existence. I was set up to address this problem. What have we done in five years? Well, first of all, the big thing was the OCR, GCSE and computing. All other exam boards, with the notable exception of SIA, unfortunately, are following suit in September. The Royal Society review into the state of computing uh, was heavily influenced by CAS. We've got bucket loads of resources on our website and wiki, including the Key Stage 1, the Key Stage 5 curriculum. Yes, Key Stage 1 can learn how to program. We also promote collaborative sharing. And we've got great courses. Uh, that's myself and some others at the Greenfoot Summer School at the National STEM Centre in York this past August. My year 12s are using a very, uh, shall we say, creative interpretation of the CAGCSE ICT spec. They are programming games in Greenfoot. Greenfoot is a nice front end to program Java. It's absolutely fantastic. Uh, we've also been talking to politicians because the politicians have come wanting to talk to us. Industry are not happy. Third level educa education are not happy because ICT is not preparing students to study computing at university. How can students make an informed choice to study computing if they have never even come across the subject? This Tuesday in Stormont, uh, one of the questions to the Minister will be about this topic and there will be a full uh, bill coming up later in the year. These excite me. These excite me because they stimulate students' creativity. They stimulate problem solving. Ooh, These do not excite me. And this very much does excite me. It's free, we're friendly, we love you, <laughs> and you will love us. Thank you very much. Oh,